What is Jadam? Well, in the 1950s and 60s, a Korean farmer named Hung Kyu Cho researched, innovated, and invented a framework of agriculture now called Korean natural farming. Decades later, Young Sung Cho was inspired to simplify and advance the principles from KNF by retaining the usage of indigenous microbes and trimming the excess pieces. Jadam is a Korean word or phrase that means people who are like nature. Within this framework, rather than utilize nine core inputs with varying application schedules, Young Sung Cho mostly broke things up into a few main categories of inputs, the microbial solution, the fertilizer, and the pesticide. And there's a bit more to it than that, which we'll get into. But I get the sense that the reason he went for a more streamlined and straightforward approach is because he found that it was hard for farmers to integrate KNF principles and inputs into their seasonal routine. So he took the approach of doing one-for-one -one replacements rather than spraying synthetic fertilizers, make this super low cost, easy to make homemade fertilizer instead. Rather than spraying harsh chemical pesticides, slot in these inputs instead that aren't harmful to the soil biology and don't kill wildlife. Cho also includes a lot of personal philosophy throughout the book. And honestly, I don't want to misrepresent him, so I won't go over all of that, but he personally has a very integrated take on his farming techniques and the philosophy for his life.